Welcome to our educational video on nasal cautery and packing. Here is a picture of the equipment that you will need to perform successful nasal cautery and anterior nasal packing. Here is a picture of the equipment list. First suction the nose, removing any clots. Physically remove additional clots using Tilly's forceps. Put cotton wool into local anaesthetic and decongestant. Place the cotton wool onto the affected side. Remove the cotton wool after two minutes. Cauterise the bleeding point, which is usually located on the anterior septum in Little's area. Look carefully for any bleeding vessels. Cauterising the septum normally turns it white. Place an aseptin cream into the nose. If cautery fails, then pack anteriorly. Remove the sheath from the rapid rhino pack and lubricate the pack using saline. Insert the pack along the floor of the nose. The ideal position is illustrated in the picture. Inflate the balloon with a syringe filled with air. Use tape to secure the balloon to the cheek. If anterior packing fails, then pack posteriorly. Here is a picture of the equipment that you will need for posterior packing. Here is an equipment list. Lubricate the catheter. Insert along the floor of the nose. Check the position of the tip behind the uvula. Inflate the catheter with sterile water. Watch the balloon inflating in the patient's oropharynx as you do this. Bring the balloon forward to tamponade the bleed. Cut a slit into a gauze piece. Place the gauze around the catheter to protect the alar cartilage and prevent alar necrosis. Place an umbilical clamp onto the catheter. Insert an anterior pack as shown in the video previously. Tape the catheter to the cheek. Thank you for watching.